Why are you all dressed up for? I'm trying to change my image. You doing a lot to make niggas like you. <laughs> trying to get people to trust me. I trust you. <laughs> Took you a minute. Sure. What? None. You lying. You ever got a girl pregnant? Why? Is Jimma pregnant? What? No, I don't know. OK, so why are you asking? Never mind. Never mind. You sure you ain't got nothing you won't tell me? I'm sure. You know, Imani gave you those condoms for a reason. Any more questions before I go? No. No. All right. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Mark Dark, and I'm back with another video. If you're new, if you love the shy, go ahead, hit that subscribe button. Like the video and leave your theories, comments, everything down below. Now, today we're going to be talking about the shy season five, episode five, the exclusive clip between Jake and Trick. They released it a few days ago, so we're going to talk about it in today's video. Now, you guys, make sure you checked out the episode five, what to expect video. I dropped that for you guys yesterday. And based off that trailer, it seems like this episode is going to be fire. Q is returning and he's going to be turning up at the same time. It's going to be a strap getting pulled out on Emmett. Now, I broke that down in the what to expect video that I did yesterday. So check it out if you have not seen it. So let's talk about this exclusive clip between Trek and Jake. And we know the topic of discussion is, have you ever got a girl pregnant? We know Jake and what he has done with Gemma. Some of you guys out there are still saying that y'all don't know if the baby is Jake's. Some of y'all say it could be somebody else's. I mean, based on what we are seeing, it's definitely looking like it's Jake's. I understand, you know what I'm saying? Because everybody, they don't trust Gemma. So they have concerns, but I do believe the baby is Jake's. Some of you guys did mention that this is just karma for what Jake and Gemma did to Kevin last season. And now they're going to have to deal with those consequences of their actions. And from the looks of it, it ain't looking too good. It's not looking too good for Jake and Gemma. And they have to make a huge decision. Well, at least from Gemma's perspective, she said she is going to have to make that decision because it is her body right now. In this clip, we can see Treg and Jake having a conversation. We know that Treg is getting himself together with the whole city council thing. He's dressed up. He is trying to change his image. He is trying to get people to trust him. We hear Jake telling him, like, look, I trust you. But we know it took some time for that to actually happen. Now, Treg understands that something is going on with Jake. Jake keep looking down and out like he wants to tell Treg something. And then they start to talk. Now, Jake does ask him, like, have you ever got a girl pregnant? And then Treg tells him why. And this is where he asks Jake, did you get Gemma pregnant? And of course, Jake is going to lie and say, hell nah, I ain't did that or whatever. But he's lying. And I'm pretty sure Treg knows. He knows. And he tells him, like, look, Imani gave you those condoms for a reason. So, you know, it is what it is. You should have been using them, plain and simple. But we know what Jake ended up doing. I told y'all, that boy Jake was raw dogging. And now it is time to face those consequences. You done knocked up Gemma and it ain't looking too good. So I'm going to ask you guys once again, based off Jake's actions, based off his body language, do you honestly believe Jake wants to keep the baby? You know, we're going to see that in the next episode as far as Jake's thoughts about the baby and if he wants to keep it. We know Maisha did state that Jake is the type to take care of his responsibilities. But based on what we've been seeing from Jake this season, he's starting to think about his future. We know he wanted to do the whole basketball thing. That didn't play out. But Jake is really starting to think about what he wants to do in the future. And I'm pretty sure he doesn't want to mess up. So that's why I'm eager to see his response and what he's going to tell Gemma. At the end of the day, we know Gemma will be telling him, it's my body. I'm going to make that decision. But you best believe that Jake is going to let her know exactly how he feels about what she's thinking about doing. And, you know, as far as Kevin and Jake, because we know when Kevin finds out about this, he's going to be like, man, that's crazy. And I'm pretty sure Jake is going to be like, man, 
I should have never messed with Jim in the first place. Now look at me. And we know Jake's going to feel very bad about this. But I talked about this in the official trailer when I was going over Jake's character that Jake and Kevin will be getting closer. And this is just based on this you know, particular fan theory because we talked about Jake and Gemma and her getting pregnant, which came true. And now that this has happened, it seems like Kevin and Jake are going to get a little bit more closer. I mean, you would think that it would be some issues, but Kevin going to be there for his boy. He's going to be there for his boy at the end of the day. He's pretty much got over what happened. I know he's not going to forget, as he told Jake a few episodes back, to stay away from Simone. But Kevin going to be there for his boy. Um, I want to know what Papa going to say. Because we know Papa and Jake, they're going to have another argument. We know this based off the trailers. I can't wait to see that because Papa, he ain't been holding back. And you already know he going to speak his mind when he find out about Jake and Gemma. Now, a lot of you guys have stated that y'all can't wait to see what her father's going to say because we know her father, he's been in Gemma's head telling her what she needs to do. He's been preparing her for her future since she was a little girl. He's been trying to make sure his baby was going to be all right, but now his baby has made a big mistake and now she's going to have to deal with those consequences. And I already know he's going to be very, very upset about this. And also, what y'all think about Duda? How y'all think Duda gonna feel about this? We know last season, Duda, he told Marcus, he was like, look, from the looks of it, your daughter is the one that seems like she's out there getting loose. And this is why Marcus hit Duda. And then we know Duda beat the crap out of him, right? But Duda told Marcus, like, look, your daughter, you know, she fast anyway. And once he finds out that she's pregnant, we talking about Duda, I already know how Duda gonna feel. He gonna be like, see, I knew I was right about that girl. I knew it. You know what I'm saying? And Marcus... He's going to have some negative feelings about Jake. This is going to get very, very ugly. I cannot wait to see the reactions of the parents and, you know, what's going to be the outcomes when it's all said and done. But as far as the whole exclusive scene, we know that Jake never told Treg the truth, but we know Treg knows. He knows something is up and I believe he's not going to let this slide. So expect to see more of Treg probably trying to get involved and figure out what's really going on with his brother, Jake. But you guys let me know, man, what do you think about the exclusive clip? Are y'all ready for episode five? We're going to continue to talk about the Shy season five this week. Stay tuned. But I want to thank you guys for all the love, all the support, and I will catch y'all on the next one. But let me get up on that of here, man. It's your boy, Mark Dark. I'm out. Peace.